I'd like to walk you through the 12-foot uh, the display. The first four-foot section is all of our domestic yokes and cross and bearing kits. You'll notice that they're all laid out in some kind of order. It, it, the order that they're laid out in is from the flow from the tractor to the implement. So we got the first peg here is our six series tractor yoke. It flows just like the, the power does from the tractor yoke, the two inboard yokes, then you have your selection of implement yokes. Same thing with the 12 series. 12 series tractor yoke, your two inboard yokes, and your selection of implement yokes. And it works that way all the way through the domestic series. You got 14, 35, and 44 below here. Below that is all of our cross and bearing kits that go with those yokes. You'll notice that our product tags are actually color coded. So a, a, color, a purple colored yoke and a purple colored cross and bearing kit they actually go together. Just a way of making uh, the merchandise easy to identify. Below that you've got our guarding and our shielding. Below that we've got the two cl add-on clutches and the profile tubing below that. In the middle section here is all of our metric components. Tractor yokes for all the different series, roll pins, snap rings, thumb pins, the replacement uh, bushings, and the actual yoke and tube assemblies as well. In the last, the last part of the display here is all of our assemblies. Uh, you'll notice that every assembly actually has a specific application uh, for, that, for that application there. And that's the Weasler display, and that's going to cover you know, the majority of what's out there. You may be in a specific region of the country where you may need to get a larger size uh, parts for different equipment that's out there. But we use the 80-20 whirl on this, on this display, and that's going to cover the, the majority that's out, that's out there.